the entrance to Spirit Halloween. This is the only one open right now in Greensboro. And they have these pictures on the windows in the front of some of the... Just examples of some of the costumes you can get. Like this interesting little skeleton person. I like the little neon skeleton. It's like a skin suit. That's pretty cool, actually. I would wear that. And it's just a little, it's just a little example. They have these big colorful pictures that you can see. And they have them on uh, all the windows in the front here of this empty building. You can see it used to be Carolina Home Furniture. I actually, I actually did not know the store had closed until I went there today. <laughs> we have all these, some of these pictures repeat. There's the front door. And they have a sign up saying they're now open. And it, you can see from the outside that it covers a pretty pretty good sized area. It's, it's going to be pretty big inside. This was a fairly large storefront. There's at least one other spirit, spirit Halloween that's supposed to open this month in Greensboro. So much fun, it's scary. Let's go see. So you first come in, you have these big displays and you can actually buy these big uh, Halloween scary things. None of them jumped at me. I was kind of hoping one of them would. But see, down on the floor you're going to see these little footprints right there. You step on that and it activates it. And all it did, like see it just moved like this a little bit and it said something about I'm going to take your pumpkin or something. I don't know, that's all he did. He just talked in a creepy voice for a few seconds and then it just stopped. <laughs> that's it. it didn't do anything else. Um, and this one is like a creepy clown. And I thought, well, surely he'll do something scary. So I stepped on that one. And all he does is kind of bobble his head and arms around and it plays creepy clown music. That's literally all it does. He doesn't even, I don't think he even said anything. Yeah, that one was, I thought that one was kind of lame. <laughs> uh, yeah, like, yeah. It's a, it's a cool display, though, that they have at the front of the store with these big, big things. Most of these are about $300 to $400. And then we have the creepy little symbol monkey, kind of like the one in Toy Story, only creepy. And that's all he does. Like, ooh, creepy. Yeah, he didn't really do anything else. They were kind of underwhelming, honestly. I like the jump spotter they had last year. Look, you can get long sleeve Spirit Halloween shirts if you want to look like you work there, or a tie-dyed shirt, or a hat. We have stuff from It over here. We have Pennywise the mask. Um, you can even get Pennywise socks. It's pretty cool. Or a little press-on it nails, those are cool. I like the little nails. It's very neat. And we have the makeup kit if you want to do the makeup yourself. And the deluxe costume. You could even do Georgie if you wanted to be Georgie. And we have that version. And then we have like a basic costume. I like these hats. These were sugar skull hats. Very cool. See? Sugar skull top hat. Very neat. The little skull and the flower there. They have a lot of cool hats. Bunch of cool stuff. We also have a Day of the Dead rose mask. That's pretty. And I love the skeleton hand bracelet. That's really cool. And we have a face tattoo. Or skeleton finger rings. Those are really pretty. I was hoping I could see them in the back, but you can see the picture there. They're, those are cool. We have a headband here. This is a really pretty hat. Look at this. I love this hat. It is so neat with the, the tool on it. I like that. And we have a lot of walking sticks like this. And they're very heavy, too. They have a bunch of different types. And these are some of the Halloween-themed t-shirts you can get here. Easy Bake Coven. <laughs> Let's Summon Demons. 
crouchy, creeping it real. They have all the t-shirts stacked up down there. We have Halloween Safety, a sitter's guide. Monsters. I wish it was Friday. <laughs> oh my gosh, we have a bunch of these Halloween. G is for ghost face. H is for Halloween. I have the gremlins up there. Trick or treat. <laughs> Scary movies and chill. Kitty's first sacrificial offering and demon cat. <laughs> Let's sacrifice Toby. <laughs> Portal to the cat dimension. Drink up witches. Big trick energy. <laughs> And they have them all nicely folded down here. They probably have to refold these a thousand times a day. People do love to unfold t-shirts. We have a sequin spiderweb poncho that's quite cool. Or a ghost poncho. These are like just basic costumes. You could get a pumpkin shirt. It's very cute. It's just a little button-down shirt with little pumpkins on it. If you have to dress up but you don't want to do anything crazy. Or you could get a pumpkin suit. That's crazy. And here we have a pumpkin shirt. It had a matching thing with it. And a pumpkin poncho. Spider leggings. I like the little headbands. They have one with little little bats on them. This one has like a haunted house on the top. And ghosts and bats. And little jingly jack-o'-lanterns. That's cute. You can even get Halloween hair scrunchies. <laughs> you could just put together a basic costume. I love the little pentagram backpack. And they have some pretty scarves down here too. Some Halloween scarves. Over here we have some wall decorations. We have some from IT. I bought a wall decoration at a Spirit Halloween last year. We have one from the Overlook Hotel. Halloween Town. I like that one. That's cool. We have Jack and Sally. You can count down the days till Halloween. It's like a little Ouija board thing. It's cute. Haddonfield. Have a knife day. Poison, drowning, claw, or knife. So many ways to take a life. Trick or treat. Even this is from IT. We have the rules of Halloween. Wear a costume, hand out treats, never blow out a jack-o'-lantern, and always check your candy. Camp Crystal Lake down there. We have Chucky dolls. You could get you a Chucky doll. How about that? They're big. And over here, I like this little crossbody bag. Look, it's like a little coffin. <laughs> That's actually... Very interesting little crossbody bag. I've never seen one quite like that. The store was surprisingly crowded. And we have a vial of blood. And a vampire tiara. Oh, that's pretty. And then I couldn't get it back up there. <laughs> and I dropped it. I need an admin moment to fix it. There, I got it. The cellophane shifted. Look at this cool ring. That's like a vampire ring. Here's a vampire walking stick. And little lanterns. And we have nightside vampire. I actually did buy some stuff in there. I'm not going to tell you what I bought. It's for later. But I did buy some stuff. And a witch flask. You can even get witch shoe covers. You got your little witchy earrings. You could do a whole little witch costume. I like the spiders. Those are cute. And they weren't very heavy either. It's very nice. We have pentagram earrings. You can even get this cool pentagram choker. Or a spider web choker. A big old spider ring. That is a ring. And a spider hand chain. Oh my gosh. Look at this cool spider ring. That is really neat. They have so many cool rings in here. Oh my goodness. 
And we have a little collection of rings here. I love these little walking sticks. Look at this one. It's so pretty. I love the top of it. It's just neat. Most of these walking sticks were $25 to $40 each. You could even get a little wand. That's very pretty, actually. <laughs> and a little witch hat. It's a mini witch hat. Or you could get a larger witch hat with feathers. We have the Eternal Witch, the Gothic Witch. They have all different types. Celestial, it's just a cape. It's a celestial cape of crushed purple velvet. Or you could get a celestial hooded robe. That's beautiful. I love that. You could be a wicked spellcaster in this cute little outfit. Or a Twilight Witch. I really like that one. That one's pretty. I've never been a witch for Halloween. I should do that. Look at this hat. I have never been a witch for Halloween. That's one thing I've never done. You could get a shirt that says support your local coven. And I love this cute little skirt. Look, it's like a little cheerleader skirt. That is so cute. I really like the skirt. You could get a witch's broom that's iridescent. That's a fun little broom. And now over here, we have the Dark Ringmaster. And a nice little wig here. You can get a little horn. A crazy clown mask. I love the giant scissors. Those are neat. <laughs> they have all kinds of props like that. like, And they're all made out of foam. Look at that. I ended up picking this one up. It was kind of squishy and it felt it was fun to hold. Because it's just, it's just like foam. It's like a dense foam rubber. Yeah, it's, it's not solid or anything. Like the Ringmaster hat. That's a really spiffy hat. And these striped top hats are very cool. You can even get killer clown teeth. Yikes. A voice changer. And here you can see in some places they will have costumes on a little mannequin and you can actually see what it looks like in person. And I think that's to keep people from opening the packages. That's the costume right there, Circus Misfit. I like this one, the dark clown, that purple costume. That's really pretty. You could get a killer clown. Twisted Trickster. That's neat. And we have Jason stuff over here. Isn't that I don't I don't watch horror movies. I don't know. We have a keychain here. That's pretty cool. I don't know. I can't keep up with horror movie people. I know Freddy Krueger. I don't think we saw any of that. Those are pins. Socks. No, that's Michael Myers. I'm sorry. I'm thinking of the hockey mask, dude. Sorry. <laughs> Whatever. So you, you have this costume here. Michael Myers. Yeah, that's it. We have the jumpsuit and the mask. Or you can just get like... You could just get the mask if you want to. I love the fact that you can buy just whole costumes or just parts of costumes. If you only need part of it, it's really great. And over here we have a skeleton reaper. We have a devil mask. I like that. The Prince of Darkness is pretty cool. You can be the devil. I can be the devil for Halloween. The Underworld Emperor. I like the little, like a werewolf or something. It's actually kind of cool. I tried to put it with the others, but it didn't, it wouldn't really stay, so. Yeah, we have a hooded robe. Ba Baphomet. I don't know if I'm saying that right. And look, they have a bunch of Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. You can get the Adam mask. That would be so much fun. You could do that or Barbara's mask when they were trying to scare Liddy, Lydia. <laughs> it's just a rubber mask or you could get a Beetlejuice mask right here. Or you could get like just a half mask and then they have the costume here. Or the, like a female version, a little dress. That's cute. 
But if I were to dress up as Beetlejuice, I would want to look like him, you know? I wouldn't want to wear the dress. Or you, they even have his wedding suit. And if you want to do the makeup yourself, they have the makeup kit for Beetlejuice. You can even get a hat that says, I myself am strange and unusual. I bought a magnet there last year that said the same thing. And they have a lot of lanyards like this one from different, just different themed lanyards. And they have the handbook for the recently deceased. And you can even dress up as a sandworm or Lydia dressed up for the wedding. <laughs> I said nightmare before Christmas. I'm sorry, Beetlejuice. I meant to say Beetlejuice. We have Killer Clowns stuff, which I have to admit I'm not familiar with, so I don't really know anything about it. These are little iron-ons and pins. We have little things like these masks. This is spiky. A spiky mask. Um, and this one is a shorty, so it's a shorty mask. That's the animatronic we saw earlier. And then that one, and you you can even get a t-shirt. And we have a jumbo costume. And a spiky costume. And the shorty costume. And back here we have one of these little projector things that casts light up on your walls and ceiling for killer clowns. That's pretty neat. And we have a cotton candy gun, which I am not familiar with. That'd be fun to have. And we even have a Killer Clowns inflatable. Wow. They have a lot of inflatables. Um, we have a bowler hat. An underworld cape. Look, at, I like it. It looks like it has flames. That's really cool. And you have these, the earring is broken, but we have unholy earrings and unholy thighs. Those are cool. And a death staff. Those things are very heavy. <laughs> yeah, I think that one was like $40. We have bat baphomet earrings and an unholy bracelet. <laughs> and the Grim Reaper. Nice. What do we have over here? Oh, God, there's so much in here. Okay, over here is the Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. Sorry. There's a lot of it. Stuff I've never seen before. Like, you can get Locke's mask right here. You can also get Stock's mask right here. And Barrel. So you can get those three. You could get their mask. You can also get Scary Ted here. <laughs> and look at these Jack Skellington gloves. They make your fingers look super long. And you can even get Beryl's lollipop. They have some very detailed and specific things. Here's Jack Skellington's suit. Oh, I'd love to wear that one year. That'd be so much fun. Oh, I would love that. Or you could get like just a t-shirt. We have socks on them, with uh, socks with Sally on them, and Jack Skellington. They're like knee-high socks. You can even get little press-on nails with a Nightmare Before Christmas theme. Here's one set. Very cute. And they have a second set like this. Oh, those are adorable. I kept thinking about doing Sally, you know, dressing up as Sally. Look at these socks. These are all little socks. I've never dressed up as Sally. I've thought about doing it. Here's a lanyard for Nightmare Before Christmas. The Sally costume. It also comes with the wig. That's cute. I've thought about doing it, but I haven't actually done it yet. <laughs> or you can buy just the wig right there. Oh, you can even get a little knit hat. That looks like Jack Skellington. And they have Wizard of Oz stuff. I did Wizard of Oz not too long ago. But I got my costume elsewhere. We have the little basket. And Toto. 
very nice and you can even get your ruby slippers right down here you could be a scarecrow from the Wizard of Oz or the Wicked Witch that'd be fun too cute little dog <laughs> yeah the baskets are adorable I like them and over here we have some Super Mario costumes we even have a marshmallow thing uh, some Rick and Morty stuff you can get a Rick and Morty hat <laughs> and some masks here we have Bob's Burgers this is Louise you can get Bob's apron and Powerpuff Girls. We have Bubbles. You can get a Buzz Lightyear costume. And this is like if you wanted to dress up as a Pizza Planet delivery person, you get the jacket and a hat in there. And it says Pizza Planet on the back. That's super cute. I would wear that, you know, just like a regular day. I'm gonna flip you upside down. It's Pizza Planet delivery. <laughs> It was just easier to flip you than that thing. You could get a Mr. Potato Head inflatable or Woody. Nice costume. And there's Buzz down there. Uh, over here we have Mickey and Minnie Mouse. You could get a Mickey Mouse costume that's adorable. I like it. You can also get a Mickey Mouse union suit and a Cerulean Crayola crayon or a shamrock crayon. Very specific. I don't think the bustier is part of the crayon costumes. <laughs> it's very cool. I don't know how you would pair that with your crayon. You can also get a violet kit. We have cat in the hat stuff. You have the big hat here that you can buy. Lots of hats and we even have suspenders. Dr. Seuss suspenders. Two types. Yeah. And you can get a package here that has thing one and thing two in it. Or you can get a thing dress that has a cute hood and little gloves. You can even get thing leg warmers. And the cat in the hat jumpsuit. Very cute. And we have some Fortnite stuff like this and that thing. <laughs> and this thing, Fortnite Drift. And we have Hocus Pocus costumes. We have Mary Sanderson here. We have this one. We have Sarah right here. And I'll find Winnie's in a minute. They have Sarah Sanderson. Sometimes they'll have like a regular version and a deluxe version of different costumes. So we have Mary and Sarah over here in some of the wigs. And then I spotted Winnie's over here. Winnie Sanderson's costume is right here. And you can even get, uh, you could be Binks the cat. And here's Winnie's wig. So you buy the wig separately. Very curly. Such that. You can even get these little hair bows. Here's Mary's hair bow. Win Winifred. And Sarah. You can get Winifred's little teeth. <laughs> and they even have some Hocus Pocus shirts. I think they only had like two. They had that one and then this one right here. And they only had one of each. They don't have a lot of inventory. I would tell you that. If you want anything, I would go look now if you have one available to go to. And here you can see what their costumes look like. They're actually kind of cute. They're, they're not too bad. That's why I went ahead and bought some stuff, so I would have it. You can be Sully from Monsters, Inc. Sully. Or Mrs. Incredible. That is a super cool costume. Or Mr. Incredible. Or Frozone. <laughs> and we have Bob Ross stuff. We have a Bob Ross wig and beard. Or you can get the full costume. It has the wig and the shirt and the palette and the paintbrush and stuff. You can even be Wilma Flintstone. This is like a random collection of costumes. Coraline. An 80s button-up. It's just the shirt. It's just a crazy 80s shirt. 
We have, down here we have Gru. You could get a face mask. Or you could get a Minions costume. Or a Miraculous Ladybug. They even have Minion goggles. And a Garth wig and glasses. It is so random. We have the Handsmaid's Tail here. Or Tina. You can even be a hot, you could be a flaming Hot Cheeto. For Halloween, you could be a big Cheeto. Uh, that one was $39.99. I looked because I thought one of my, my younger son might be interested in that. He loves those things. You could get Napoleon Dynamite. Average Joes from Dodgeball. Yeah, it's just so random right here. And over here we have all the Harry Potter stuff. We have these knee-high socks here. We have different ones. We even have lanyards over here for Harry Potter stuff. And a sparkly tie from uh, Ravenclaw. And um, Gryffindor. And Slytherin. I'm bouncing a little bit because the music was actually... They were playing... Um, Shoot, what was the song they were playing? Uh, all about, uh, all about that bass, or all that was playing, and I don't know why I was just getting into it. <laughs> I try not to bounce too much as I show you all this stuff. <laughs> we have wands, all the different wands, and we have some costumes up here as well. I we have different ones up here. They were kind of hard to see. They were up above me. Check out these glasses. These are cool. They only had one pair of those, though. Some things they only had one of, and that's why I went ahead and bought some stuff. I was afraid it would be out later. We have some stuff from Stranger Things. You can get the family video vest. You can get these pins from Stranger Things. Or the Eleven costume. Here. Argyle and Eleven again. And you can get a track jacket or a high uh, the cheerleader costume. Hopper. I've never actually watched the show, so I don't know anything about it. You can also get some Harry Potter cardigans. And these were actually quite nice. These were nice cardigans. I think they had two types. I don't think the dog costume goes there, but it's very cute. Look at that. I do tricks for trees. It doesn't go there, but I moved it. We have Harry Potter's glasses, too. And look over here. We have all of our steampunk stuff. We have a steampunk vest. That's cute. Check out these, check out these goggles. Oh, my God. I love the sparkly goggles. And, and we have a steampunk staff. There's the vest again. That's cool. We have a neat little armor ring. Look at that. There's definitely a statement ring. And you can get your steampunk hat with goggles attached. Which is very cool. That's all right. I was trying to find a pair that had, or find a hat that had, yeah, this one. I wanted to look at one with the brown tool on it. I really like that one with the brown little stuff, the tool hanging from it. We even have crocheted thighs and steampunk finger rings. Interesting. We even have steampunk earrings. We have a couple of types and more goggles. Very interesting. A little jabot or however you say it. And a waist cincher. Interesting. It says one size fits most. You can get a steampunk mask thingy, like a plague mask. And they have these cute little peasant tops. You can get a whole costume here, steampunk girl. It comes with the dress and other stuff. Or you can get Queen of Steam. Dress, goggles, choker, and waist cinch. And we have the Victorian steampunk as well. Or 
This is dapper steampunk. Steampunk peasant dress. And over here we have these long jackets. These are very cool. My cat is meowing at me, I'm sorry. <laughs> and we have these cool, like, vest thingies. Those are neat too. Um, and here we have a pocket watch. You can even get a bag of gears if you want to glue them onto stuff, or a bag of keys. And here's a little eye mask. I like that. Nice little collection of stuff. <laughs> they have several different types of goggles, too. And here's a little face mask. And your steampunk gloves. They even have these little adhesives for your face if you want to decorate your face. And here's another steampunk staff. I think it was like $40, though. Yikes. You can even get steampunk pants or a cute little skirt. With a little thing attached to it. That's, that's adorable. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Over here we have a, a warrior cloak. Cloak and a wooded huntress. Alright, moving on, we have, we have astronaut jumpsuits and a yacht captain costume, a SWAT vest, red hot hottie, <laughs> oh my gosh, combat cutie, <laughs> special forces babe, <laughs> whatever you're looking for you probably find, a SWAT cat suit, Sassy soldier. <laughs> oh my god. Over here, you could be a bank robber. Look at this. You could be a burglar. You can't get a prisoner shirt. <laughs> the heck. They have fog machines and lights. Look at these pretty purple lights. I'm thinking these might actually work for a Christmas tree I want to do this year. <laughs> they had them in purple and orange. And they have purple lights down here too. Purple light bulbs. Um, little LED lights here. They have a bunch of other stuff up there. They have fog machines. They have this low-lying fog machine. And you can get fog juice here too. You can get big things of fog juice. And a fog hose and adapter and little things of fog juice. And this is, uh, let's see, that's the low lying. That's a 400 watt fog machine. They had a bunch of metal lunch boxes too. Um, we'll see some more later. We have that one. We have a Killer Clowns lunch box. They were metal. Hocus Pocus. They were empty. They didn't have anything in them. Or you could get a Scooby Doo lunch box. Very cute. We have a Star Wars mask up here. They had several of those. And these are super plush throws. And they have Friday the 13th. This one's pretty. Be Wild Moonchild. I like that one. It was kind of sparkly. It had like a glittery look to it. We have one here from yeah, the Mystery Machine. We have a little quote from Edgar Allan Poe from one of his poems. It's very soft. You can even buy pajamas in here. Look at this. We have Chucky pajamas. We have so many types. They even have Kremlin's pajamas. I like those. And we have like the ghost face too. And we have some Stitch, Lilo and Stitch stuff. I like the little backpack. And you can even get a stitch costume. A little knit hat. And they have a lanyard for that too. And we have Teletubbies. Uh, no. <laughs> Next. This freaked me out. We have some Yellowstone stuff, which I've never watched, but we have Rip Wheeler, Beth's jacket. I don't think the nurse scrubs go over here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they don't, but I don't know where they go. 
This store is big. We didn't even look at everything. We have humor hats. He can get a horse. Although I will warn you, everybody was trying these hats on. <laughs> it's a good way to get lice. <laughs> we have avocado and toast. We have these couples outfits like milk and cookies. Very cute. Peanut butter and jelly. How about that? You can even get soap and a loofah. <laughs> you could be a squirrel for Halloween or a gorilla. Up here we have a teddy bear piggyback. It looks like the teddy bear is carrying you. You can be a Bavarian person with your lederhosen. Cute. I like this one, the little skin suit that looks, it's lit up to look like a stick man. You could get an inflatable dinosaur. You could even be a taco or chips and salsa. Very cute. You could be a banana. A banana. <laughs> or you could be a white clam seltzer spiked seawater with a hint of dirty clam juice. Natural slime. <laughs> okay. That's all I'm going to say about that. All the innuendos get worse. Just hang on. They get worse. Over here we have like our gangsters and our 20s stuff. We have a neat pocket watch. A dapper gentleman. We have a rhinestone studded cigarette holder. Very fancy. If you want to be like a flapper or something. A gangster hat. You could be a gangster. <laughs> We have our pearls, and I love the bustiers. It's made to look like a, a gangster. Look at that. Very cool. I like it. We have our little headband, and we have the speakeasy sweetie. That is a cute dress. And the flashy flapper. I like that one, too. Oh, my goodness. And we have poodle skirts and a pink satin jacket. Very neat. I like the little jacket. Um, we also have rhinestone glasses here and a 50s pearl jewelry set. And here's the poodle skirt right here. I've already done that though. <laughs> and you could be a scarecrow or a haunting scarecrow. Either one. And we have some scarecrow hats. And over here we have witch doctor jewelry. Here's the pendant. Like a little skull. And we have witch doctor gloves. And a mask. And we have a scary scarecrow kit. And a voodoo mask. Oh my goodness. And they even have a witch doctor hat. And for some reason this hat makes me think of Crocodile Dundee. Because I think he had like big crocodile teeth or something in his hat. And it, it kind of looked like that hat. <laughs> I just picked it up and it made me think of Crocodile Bundy. <laughs> we have Naughty Nuns galore. We have the Bad Habit Nun. Very funny. Twisted Sister. Sinful Sister. And then just Nun. And then we have <laughs> Blessed Babe. You can even get a holy water a big old priest cross, nun kit, the book of holy hammered. I'm going to hell. All right, and over, it's getting, oh, this is bad. Okay. So we have Dick's morning wood service. Need wood. We've got it. Camel towing. We pull it out when it's in tight. More hose plumbing service. In and out automotive lubrication expert. Oh, Jesus. Rock hard call king. Oh, God. They have bongs down there, too. We have beer bongs and stuff. Uh, see? Bongs. We even have shirts. Look at these shirts. Oh, my goodness. Pipe laying expert. We lay pipe all night long. This one says, morning, more hose, plumbing service, laying pipes since 1969. More hose, laying pipes. I 
I forgot to look at the back of this one. The deeper we go, the more you say, whoa. Uh, I kind of feel like Carl needs one of these shirts. <laughs> and we have Johnny Hardwood's Landscaping Seed Supplier. We'll whack your bush and mow your lawn. <laughs> I like the graphics on these too. You can get a mullet and stash. What does this shirt say? This one is more hose again. What about this plaid? Dick's morning wood. Hey, your dick. <laughs> oh God, put it back, Mary. I had to keep going. This is in and out automotive lubrication expert, deep pipe inspection. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it. Get me out of here. You could be a pool boy, deep end. <laughs> Lion, you could get it. Okay, let's move on. Lions, monkeys, a little Dalmatian costume. <laughs> oh, yes. You could be a cow. Uh, over here we have the 80s stuff. We have an aerobic workout. I actually kind of like that that one piece thing there. That's cool. That was $39.99. I like that costume. We have our big belt and our necklaces, our groovy glasses and scrunchies, leg warmers, a glam rocker, or an 80s workout tracksuit. That's cute. We have tie-dyed shirts down there. Our little packs. Look at our look at our little thingy there. Our fingerless gloves. We even have some cool headbands and bracelets. And these earrings are just too cool. We have little press-on 80s nails. You can even be a pimp. Like they have like pimp stuff. Look, you can get money, some big money fake money. You could be a hip-hop, you could get a hip-hop tracksuit, gold pimp. I want the gold pimp costume or a, a cheetah robe, hustler, hustler honey, that's cute, very 60s looking, or a, sh or a robe, a red robe down there. Here we have the Cheetos costumes. Again, you could get a Cheetos dress and socks. And a hot Cheetos hat. The flaming Hot Flavor. And if you eat all those Cheetos, you're going to need that doctor costume right there. Uh, so there's the Cheeto again. Down here, you can even look, you can even look like a bag of flaming Hot Cheetos. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, everybody was trying these hats on. So, like, everybody was putting these freaking hats. I like the cowboy. Oh, no, I'm sorry. That's like a sheriff's hat. Very nice. They have a plain black hat, a little beret, all the hats, a little captain's hat. I like the little crowns down here. You could get a crown. Wow. A witch's hat. I like this colorful witch's hat. That's pretty. It's very cool. A viking hat. Fireman's hat. I like the big top hats. They're very tall. You can even get a traffic cone hat. <laughs> oh, me. And you have your ears and tails over here from different types of animals. Little cat tail. And your ears. Oh, I like these studded ears. And these are flashing light up cat ears. Neat. And over here, let's see, we have some wigs. Retro mullet. Or a regular mullet and a wig and mustache if you want to rob a bank or something. We even have solid color stuff over here if you just need something in a solid color, like these cute little shorts. They have a little bit more over here. I think they were still putting stuff out. We have a bit of a selection of wigs, not as many as they had last year. I like that one. It reminds me of cotton candy. That's pretty. <laughs> Um, oh, this green and yellow one is neat. I like that one. It's pretty. 
And yeah, they maybe they're still putting stuff out. You can get a little ruffled collar. And we have some col solid color t-shirts here and leggings and masks and things. And over here, all these are hairsprays. It's like temporary hair color. We have like orange. See, it's just a color spray. Yeah, I like the lighter blue. I like that. Pretty colors. I like, yeah, I like that light blue. I like this white satin bustier. Isn't that pretty? Very neat. What do we have over here? I missed a bunch of stuff up front. I really hated it. We have a mini witch hat. We have all kinds of, like, another pair of big scissors. Swords. Axes. This sword was massive. It's huge. And it was kind of heavy. They're all made out of, like, dense foam. Interesting masks here. It's a bull scarecrow mask. Very interesting. I really like it. <laughs> I like that one. It's intriguing. A little mask there. Here's another bull. He looks scared. A horse. You can get the blood harvest mask, chest, and hands kit. And it's like kind of like it, sort of. The Purge. And we have here, what is that? Emperor Palpatine. A little skeleton. There's the saw thing. And right here we have our ears and tails. <laughs> little pig ears and nose and tail. And we have a lot of makeup over here. This is the little makeup section. They have makeup in other parts of the store, too. And here's some. Over here you can get, like, scars. You can get some little fake scars. Little devil horns. Yeah, just a bunch of different things. You can get, ooh, nightmare fangs. And a bald head. <laughs> More solid color stuff. I like that bustier. I keep looking at the bustiers. <laughs> I just like them. I think they're cool. I don't know. I'm just drawn to them. We have spray blood. Lots of blood. A vampire makeup kit. These are cool. They're little vampire teeth in their own little container. Little vampire teeth. Cute. Um, you have little devil accessories over here. You have your devil accessories, like the little horns. They have rhinestones on them. Nice. And some wings here. They're kind of sparkly. Or you can get your angel stuff. You can be the angel or a devil. An iridescent kit. All kinds of sides and thingies. That one's cool. Pitchforks and things. They even have floor mats, like place mats. That one's neat. Here's one from another one from it here. Um, here's one from uh, yeah, Hocus Pocus. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, and a Ouija board one too. Over here we have a stuffed dummy prop. They had those last year. And we have decor over here for your haunted home. A ghoul. <laughs> and we have more lunch boxes here. And we have some gel clings from it. You can put those on your window. I really like this mantle decoration from the Nightmare Before Christmas. I kind of thought about getting one, but I didn't. I kind of wish I had. It was $16.99 and it comes with lights. I may actually go back and get that. We have some pretty tablecloths, too, for Halloween. Different types. A little metal haunted house. And more plush throws. Here's one from Hocus Pocus. And it. This one's nice from The Nightmare Before Christmas. Little table decorations. <laughs> All kinds of cute things you can buy. I like the little pillows. These are cute. And there's a bunch of stuff up here. They have some wreaths up here that are really pretty. That one's cool. 
I like this one here, the crescent moon. That one's neat. That'll look pretty with lights in it. It might have lights in it. And that's a neat tablecloth too. A little dish thing here. You could put your change in or something. Neat pillow. Live by the sun, drink by the moon. Little pillow. Over here we have a hanging phantom ghost. Five and a half feet tall. I want to put that in the tree on the side of my house. They even have an inflatable hearse. And look at these crazy skeletons. <laughs> I was laughing at that. That's awesome. A jack-o'-lantern archway. That thing is nine feet tall. I love it. Oh my god, I love it. I want that so bad. <laughs> and the hearse too. Oh man, we have little lanterns. We have pathway markers. They light up and play this creepy musical sound. Look, <laughs> I like the jack-o'-lanterns. Little lanterns. You get three of these in this kit. They just light up. They don't make any sound or anything. The red ones are cool like that, but the thing was missing. And a little inflatable ghost. And we have more floor mats over here. Welcome, foolish mortals. So, you know, we have the crazy clown, sorry, killer clowns thingy down there. Some hocus pocus stuff. Oh my god, so much stuff. And we did, I missed some somehow. I ended up missing some stuff. This is all hocus pocus stuff. Uh, like wall decorative items and table decorations and throws and things. And Nightmare Before Christmas. You can count down to Halloween. This is a wall decoration. It's very cool. I like that. And we have some wall hangings up here. Welcome to Halloween Town. And we have some wine glasses. Some stemless wine glasses. And an Oogie Boogie cup. We even have an oogie boogie, like a pillow. It's squishy. And some cups and little coffee cups. Pillows. We even have an operation game with the Nightmare Before Christmas theme where you have to operate on oogie boogie. <laughs> oh, over here we have the empty soul girl on a swing. And we have big creepy dolls. And here's the jumping spider. They had one of those set up last year. I thought it was hilarious. I liked it. Lord Raven. And a cute little wolf. And a little skeleton. And I love the sandworm. Oh, I would love to put that in my yard too. <laughs> I love the sandworm. Oh, it's neat. We have Betty Sharp. And all kinds of outdoor decorations. Those are our kids' costumes, I think. And we have lots of coffee cups. Look at all these coffee cups. Gremlins. Whatever that is. Lilo and Stitch, Nightmare Before Christmas. Oh, man. But I was running out of time, so I, I, did, I did end up missing some stuff. I'm sorry. We have a sitting scarecrow. Nozzles the Clown. And we have some capes over here. A velvet hooded cape. Red capes. That's a pretty dress. And now we're back at the front of the store again. And we, yeah, we already saw all this. Yes. Oh my gosh. It's always so much fun to come into Spirit Halloween and look at all the goodies. 